My name is Ayoka Chenzira. I'm an interactive digital media artist and filmmaker. Ordinary on any given day is my new interactive installation. I was thinking about many of my students who want to make their mark in society in some way, and they're thinking, you know, Martin Luther King, he did such amazing things. How could I do something uh, like that? I hear about Sojourner Truth. How could I do something like that? They don't think of them as ordinary people. Uh, struggling and trying to make things work. And so the installation is called Ordinary on Any Given Day because it really is these small acts that uh, happen one after one after one and the aggregation helps to make the world a better place. In many ways I've been a traditional filmmaker for much of my life even though I've always experimented with film. Uh, I wanted to begin, though, to bring the moving image to interface with the computer uh, and other kinds of technologies. I'm interested in interactive engagement with an audience viewer participating uh, in making a work grow and develop. And I'm interested in thinking about this whole idea of cinema as being much more than something that you just see in a movie theater. There are some amazing people who agreed to be interviewed for this installation. For example, the Olympic athlete uh, Tommy Smith, who people know him from that famous iconic image of the athletes during the 1968 uh, Mexico uh, Olympics, Kelsey and Rachel Oaken. They are the young girls, really young girls, who founded the organization Thanks USA. Um, to date, they've raised $6.5 million, and they founded the organization when they were 10 and 8 years old. Yensina Larson, who is the founding uh, director of World Pulse, and World Pulse is an organization that has managed to connect over 40,000 women in 185 countries. Ambassador Andrew Young uh, talks about the fact that he really didn't want to be mayor of Atlanta. And he tells an incredible story about his aha moment, the iconic activist Angela Davis. Many people think about her or know about her only within the context of being on the FBI's 10 most wanted list. She shared that she had been hired by a university uh, to teach a class in, in Marxism and Continental Philosophy. She discovered that an FBI agent had put out a notice that UCLA had just hired its first communist professor. And suddenly she was thrust into the public eye did not really know if she could if she could deal with it and didn't quite frankly know how to deal with it and she references uh, Audre Lorde by saying that we have to be able to move through our fears. People are not waiting for the next messiah if you will. People are not just sitting down saying oh woe is me, um, when is something going to get better. There really is activity happening globally. Attached to the interactive installation Ordinary on Any Given Day is a social media campaign where we are asking people to join and participate in 30 days of making the world a better place. Your commitment to social good can become part of the interactive installation. We're asking you to tweet, upload photos that will be incorporated into the installation. It can be something very small or it can be a larger community volunteer effort. It really is up to you. And you can find out more about how to do this by going to our website, OrdinaryDayAct.com.